decided to revisit a location that I once hit before. Um, if you see back there, there's electrical outlet right above there. At one point, this was probably lived in. Um, about the only nice thing left in here <laughs> are these shades over those. And this place has gotten a lot worse than what it was the first time I was in here. People have clearly just smashed glass to smash glass. Cool round window in there. Um, you would have had your bathroom in here. Shower area, fixtures. I mean, some of the glass is still intact. A little cabinet over here. But a lot of it's missing. Um, and then, as you can see out here, dude, this it was pretty cool. I mean, there's no re why people have to smash the glass, especially on something like this. Um, one, it's not yours. Two, what's the purpose? What joy are you getting out of doing so? Um, because this is pretty neat. I mean, clearly, nature is taking its time on it. We got a, a little ice thing there that was clearly used for, like, beads and tools and whatnot. That's pretty neat. Um, super cool antifreeze. Tack box there. Some uh, dishes. And that's where a sink would have been right there. And again, we have outlets in here. Um, this guaranteed was somebody's living quarters at one point. There's another outlet over there. And the uh, last time I was here, it didn't look like this. And it's kind of sad. Like, what's the purpose of blowing out that window? And clearly, like, let's look outside. Whew, as we sink into the floorboards. Yep, you can see the glass outside. So it was done from inside. Um, now this glass over here, there's glass on the inside. So maybe that was done from the outside. But this is a really neat trailer. Um, it was a tall, long trailer, and again, we have outlets over there. I'll go outside and try to, uh, there's the stairs to get outside, or the stepping area, just to give you a little look at um, this thing here. It's really neat. And I, I pass by this often. I don't stop at it often, but you can definitely see, let's get that out of the way. Hold on, I'm bending a tree down. That way you guys can get a better view. Um, definitely see this it the age on it and for people just to come by and bust it up is beyond me man like really it's definitely dated definitely cool um somebody probably lived on this property at once you can see their stuff back here which i didn't see the stuff back here last time i was here it's a little look at the back of the tow along rv because it was a tow along but again I guarantee somebody had electricity out here at one point. Just uh, some barrels, little burn area. Looks like a little ortho pump right there to spray weeds and stuff. And then there was another camper over here that was dilapidated the first time that I came. Um, it's over here. But again, this, this clearly was somebody's property at one point. And now somebody's house at one. Oh, here, here you go. So, dude, scrap prices are so low right now. That's why they're busting it. I, okay, that's why they're busting the glass out. This is aluminum right here. So they're blowing the glass out to take the framework from around the windows so they can scrap it for aluminum. Scrap is, it, again, even if scrap was high, I don't condone it. But especially now, scrap is so low, it's not even worth the time doing it. Um, <laughs> but here we'll go over here. I mean, I don't know why they haven't gotten into this one, or maybe they have, but there's a lot of sheet aluminum on this one. Like this, I could see doing this. This was dilapidated the first time that I came. Scrap this, dude. They leave that alone. Like, <laughs> but you know. People, if they can get their hands on it, they're going to get their hands on it and uh, deem it for the taking and try to profit off of it. But alright guys, I'm Jay Drone. If you haven't subscribed, smash the subscribe button. Questions, comments, concerns down below. Get at me.